welcome uh, the President of the Republic of Armenia, His Excellency Dr. Armen Sarkisyan. Well, good evening, ladies and gentlemen. Good evening, dear friends. I think this innovation uh, forum is, is a great achievement. I would like to, to thank those who have organized that. And when I think personally about this, there are initially two figures that come to my mind, and sometimes the third one as well. So one, I want to describe this group that is the author or the, the locomotive of all of these ventures, be that charitable, be that business, philanthropic, sometimes they're adventures as well. Well, I, I think I could name them as the Three Musketeers. The, the Three Musketeers of Armenia, in that huge space of science, technology, innovation, charity, and so on and so forth. In any case, whatever they have done is great, and I congratulate them for the lifetime achievement. And I think what I would like to mention, that none of them is doing this and expecting to be thanked. That's the most important thing that you do in your life, when especially you are doing some charitable work, or you are devoting your life to your nation. Never expect anybody saying thank you. If anybody says thank you, that's a huge bonus. This conference, and whatever FAST is doing here, I'm not going to, you all know what they are doing here. I think I will also describe something like Back to the Future, because we all speak about artificial intelligence, innovation. The reality is we're living in a world now that we're not the only nation and it's not the only city or republic that is going to fight or to compete for the new technology of the future. Because this is a time, this is a time of, in time and space, it's unique, it's a crossroad. The whole world is changing and changing rapidly. We are entering the 21st century in the year 2020, not 2000. <laughs> this, is, this is the real gateway. And of course, back to reality is that we all have to realize that our future is not to repeat what has been done already. Our future is not IT technology. Our future is not what was done in biotechnology before. Our future is definitely artificial intelligence, mathematical modeling, and big data management, so on and so forth. It is the time that big nation and a small state can have success. It is the time. This conference will help us to come back to reality. Back to reality in a, in a way that we cannot be proud of what we have achieved in IT technology and say, here we are, we are there, we are not. We cannot cheat us saying that we are the only one or the best. We are not. We are in a competition with the whole world. And for Armenia, I think having this sort of events, having institutions like FAST, having the conference here is back to reality to realize there is only one way we can win in this competition, and that way is that this has to become a national, not a state, but a national mission, a mission for all of us. And all of our friends who live in Armenia, who are there to support us, because without a mission, we will not be there. We have to consolidate all of our knowledge, know-how, all of our brilliant minds, be that in Silicon Valley in California, in New York, or in uh, Cambridge University, you men mentioned it, or in France, or, or in Italy, or in Russia, and consolidate, work hard, and be very, very disciplined, because we are going to be, compete with the best of the world. We have proved during the history that we can win the championship of the world in many subjects, be that mathematical Olympiads, or chess, or many other things. But this is the one which is going to be defining our future for the next 30, 40, 50, or maybe more. This is a wonderful opportunity. And this is also something that will help us to realize that we should not be afraid of artificial intelligence. Should not. This takes me back around 40 years ago when everybody was afraid of IT, computers, oh, the computers will come, we'll lose all of the jobs, there'll be no accountants, no this, no that. What we saw is the other way around. We have 
The world has created hundreds of millions of new jobs because of IT. And the world is going to create billions of new jobs because of artificial intelligence. And don't be afraid of artificial intelligence. Because the machines, the artificial intelligence, doesn't have two or three qualities that are human. Well, of course, you will all love me to say that that quality is love, which is true. But there is one fundamental one. Artificial intelligence, the machines, they are not capable of making mistakes. We are human. We make mistakes. But making mistake in an environment where there are laws or canon, making a mistake is the only way for evolution. This is the way the universe is made. We are a result of that because we are here because somebody years ago, thousands and thousands of years ago, was mutated. And that mutation was more powerful than the ordinary. So, mistake, which is human, is a powerful tool. And there is no way that any artificial intelligence can beat the natural one. Thank you very much.